Hey guys, and welcome to another video. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a bit of a spotlight on a really, really awesome uh, website and tool that has been released fairly recently for Factorio. It's actually pinned on the subreddit. If you follow the subreddit, you probably already know this. However, if you don't, I wanted to spotlight this. Uh, it's not really a mod spotlight because this isn't actually a mod, um, but it's really, really cool. So. If any of you have, uh, you know, paid attention to the subreddit or just found them on YouTube or I think maybe one of them was featured in Friday Facts, I'm not sure. Um, but these people, uh, several people have been making uh, songs in Factorio with the programmable speakers and tons of combinators and stuff. There's several YouTube videos of them. It's really, really awesome, um, you know, where they, they import song files or, or MIDI files in this case. And, and they make them with the combinators and it's pretty complicated for someone who doesn't really understand combinators. And uh, this guy has made um, uh, MGA Boar, uh, he made this site, which is really cool. So he, he is one who's created his own songs um, and then recently came up with this site. And what this does is this pretty much is as easy as you can get um, to make these on your own. So this lets you make um, songs in Factorio from whatever song you want almost and uh, without having to know any knowledge of combinators or anything it's really awesome so what you do is you take a MIDI file and a MIDI file is I had to do a little research on this because I wasn't actually sure uh, I guess it's like a file that is used a lot by games and such that only includes like the instrumentals of a song um, or something to that effect I could be wrong but uh, you either need to find a converter or there's several websites, which I will link in the description. There's several websites that have uh, tons of really popular, you know, well-known songs um, already as MIDI files. Um, for this, I'm going to be using a uh, non-copyright song since this is a YouTube video. I don't want to be using a copyrighted song. Um, a copyright free song rather is what I'm going to use. Um, but again, I will link in the description sites where you can find uh, MIDI files of like pretty much any popular song you can think of. And then there's also converter sites that you can convert um, mp3s to MIDI files. So what you do is you drag a MIDI file once you have it into this requester chest and the site is midiatorio.com is uh, his site that he's created. And uh, and yeah, so you take your MIDI file, which I have here, and you drag it, this is actually really cool, you drag it into the requester, it plops it in here and the machine works, and here you go. And uh, which I really like this. So this is the info it gives you. Now this is some important information here. Uh, for this particular song, we're lucky that all the uh, instrumentals and stuff are within range. However, with some songs, and this is what you have to be careful with sometimes, is uh, depending on like the, you, you know, the, the song and, and, you know, the beat and, and all the instrumentals, some of the notes can be out of out of the range and you can adjust these and uh, you can see here, notes can be aligned to the Factorio note ranges below. For more information, see guide. So we're going to open the guide he's written here. And uh, it tells you what to do. Um, if any notes are higher or lower than what their instrument can play in Factorio, uh, a red arrow and the number of notes will appear. Uh, these notes will not be heard in game. You can attempt to fix these by either changing the Factorio instrument or by shifting the notes up and down, either from the instrument or the track. Please note that the instruments and tracks contain the same set of notes. Each note will get shifted by both its instrument and track. Um, so this is important because I've tried it with songs that have like a ton of notes like out of the range and even moving them around seems to really mess it up. So some songs won't work too good, uh, but this one luckily does. So what you do is you then just click here, you get blueprint. And what this does is this creates a blueprint for you of all the combinators and everything already needed to have this song play in Factorio, which is the really cool part. So you just get your song, you put it in here, you get your blueprint, and then you put it into the game, which I'll hop into here in a second. But um, so you can just click here to copy it to your clipboard and you're good to go. Um, but also there's add-ons, which are really cool. And I'll explain those as well. So there's three different types. There's a time display um, and a bigger time display. I'm gonna use the bigger one in game. Same thing, um, you just copy the clipboard and the instructions here. Um, connect the red wire from the song memory to the red wire on the pole. Now this confused me a little bit for a minute because if you know me at all, I'm absolutely terrible with circuit stuff, but I did figure it out. It's actually really simple. So I will show you how to do that. And then also this is super cool, the piano visualizer. And this will show like the piano notes being hit along with the song. 
Connect the combinators on the left um, to the green wire that goes to the speakers. The first column of combinators are filters, which I'll show in game. Um, set the signals for the instruments you want to include in the display. Keys can be individually colored through the decider combinators above them, which I'll show. So just a quick mention here, there are add-ons, which are even uh, just really cool. This is an absolutely fantastic site and tool he's created. So let's hop into game. And I've already imported these in, but you would just import the blueprint string like normal here. So I'm just going to paste and I have it. And here it is. It's already built. It's already ready for me. Everything's good to go. So you just paste this in like that. And uh, you just need to power it. And there's a play switch here, which you just turn this combinator on and off um, to start the song or stop it. And then a reset, um, which will reset it to the beginning. So I'm going to plug in all these um, add-ons too with this before we play. So I got the big time display. Again, you just get the blueprint string, import it, and we go. So this guy, I'm going to connect up here. Try to, all right. So now what you need to do is it's very simple. You just connect the red wire from this pole. So you click with a red wire, connect from this pole, and you connect it to this combinator down here. Now I don't have uh, enough reach, so you just can put another pole here um, just to span the wire distance. Okay, so he's hooked up. That's all you have to do for that. Just from this pole to this combinator. And uh, obviously the, the combinators will change depending on the song, but this should still be pretty much the same. Um, and then for the piano display, I'm gonna stick this over here. It's quite large, but again, the fantastic thing about this is you don't really have to mess with anything if you don't want. You don't have to know combinators. You don't have to know circuit networks. Um, and it's just awesome. I mean, playing fa songs in Factorio with the programmable speakers is amazing in itself. But I mean, if you wanted, you know, um, I think you could have your speakers play globally and you could just listen to music in the game if you wanted to. Now, you know, it may have a performance hit and stuff, but um, so then what you do here is it's very, very simple. You just take um, from this in speaker, the green wire, you just connect this to this first combinator here. And these are all wired together and that will make that work. So now this is where you set your notes. I'm not going to change them um, because I don't actually have quite enough knowledge. I guess these are just notes like A, uh, B, C, D, E, F, and G um, for the notes. You know, I'm not sure what all this song uses because I'm not really a music person in terms of that knowledge. So I'm not going to mess with those, but it will still work. And then here's where you set your colors. Um, you would just change this. Um, don't change this. Uh, you still want to output one, but change the color. It's going to display all white here, but if I wanted, I could change the colors. For example, if we just, uh, let's just change this to like red, for example. Let's just change this entire uh, section here to red and hopefully not break it in the process. And uh, and then you just give it power. And of course I'm in cheat mode, but you know, you would just connect up power. Okay, so everything's connected. And then to start it, you just hit play. And I'm going to be silent here. I'm not gonna play the whole song because it's several minutes. I'm gonna play maybe the first 30 seconds or so. But I'm gonna not talk during it, and this is in-game music, and it sounds really good for being played in Factorio. So I'm gonna stand down here. I should be able to open this from here. And here we go, guys. All right, so there we go. Um, so what I did there is I just hit the reset to set it back to the beginning, um, and then I'm gonna turn this off, and I just turn this combinator off, um, and then I could just restart. So there you go, and you notice that the ones I changed, these notes were red, so you could color this however you like. The timer was going along with it, and it is as simple as that. Um, and I do wanna give credit, this song is uh, 
Monody or Monody by Fat Rat. It is copyright free and the info for it will be in the description. Um, if you want to check out the actual song, it's one of my favorite songs actually. It's really good. So there you go. And again, I will link also sites to where you can find uh, very popular, well-known songs. Uh, you know, for your purposes, it's probably fine if they're copyrighted because you wouldn't necessarily be making videos of them. But, uh, but yeah, there you go, guys. So Meditorio, extremely awesome uh, tool, website, major props to the guy who made it. And, uh, and yeah, if you have any other questions, feel free to leave them down in the comments. I'm pretty sure I covered everything. It's just, I mean, it's so cool because, you know, I really wanted to make songs and, you know, I don't have a clue how to do this. You know, I don't know what any of this stuff does, but you don't have to. You just... Grab your song, import it, get your blueprint, stick it in. You can do add-ons. You don't have to do add-ons. And uh, it is as simple as that. And one quick note, just for anyone who's wondering, if you want to increase the volume of this in-game, um, it's the game effects volume. I played around. It's a, not alert, so I thought it would be. Um, but the game effects volume seems to increase and decrease this. Now, obviously, it's going to increase <laughs> the rest of the game effects volume. So you may want to be careful with that i'm sure there's some more tweaking you could do maybe but anyway there you go guys as always thanks for watching i hope you found this helpful definitely check it out link obviously to meditorial in the description as well and uh if you enjoyed feel free to leave a like but until next time i look forward to seeing you all and do take care